the simplicity of using the Dake Annotated Reference Bible. It has a very simple system. Uh, if you know the alphabet, you will be able to use the Dake Annotated Reference Bible. Brother Dake begins his chapters or books. The book simply just begins with a small outline of what's taking place. And how the book breaks down. And then he ends his chapters with a summary of the books. He doesn't have like uh, the Common Man, Reference Bible, the Ruckman, uh, Schofield, all of those Bibles. They have an introduction to the books. Brother Dake opted more for a uh, summary of the books. Very simple system used in this four note, four column note Bible. Over here are notes for this Bible text, this column. Bible text notes on this column. If you know your alphabet, begins with A, travels down, and you will have a corresponding A. And here's one of the uh, prophetical stars. So it's telling us that there is a prophecy here. But it is uh, corresponding over here. It's the second prophecy in Isaiah. It's unfulfilled and will be fulfilled in the millennium. And he has a summary note on page se <coughs> 732. Excuse me. <clears throat> Very simple to follow. <clears throat> Chapters are numbered throughout the Bible. The text is about an eight or a nine as far as the text. And the notes are probably a seven or an eight. They're not quite as big. Very easy to read. This Bible has been in use since 1985. And it's seen a lot of use. Marked up. But... This Bible has more material in it than any study Bible I ever seen. Now, I have the Schofield, I have the Thompson, I have uh, the Ruckman. Uh, I don't have a common man reference Bible because I can't get by uh, the flat earth stuff. But anyway, uh, all of those Bibles probably if you put them together would not have the note material and the references he gives references where he finds everything Uh, it's not a center column reference system like those other Bibles I mentioned, but 
they're included in the note. It's a very good system. You should check it out. Thank you.